The goal of my research is to reduce stunting in young children living in low resource settings and to address a problem that we call hidden hunger, which is nutrient deficiencies that are related to poverty in large part. Stunting is important because in the short term, um, it may precipitate infectious disease morbidities and even mortality. And in the long term, it has um, developmental consequences as well as intergenerational effects. I don't think any one food is gonna save the world or solve world hunger. Um, rather, we have to think about the entire diet and a diverse diet. The focus of our research has been on animal source foods that are affordable in low resource settings. Animal source foods provide nutrients that are highly bioavailable for young children in particular. But we selectively choose the animal source foods that are affordable in communities that are you know, also enduring poverty. Those foods might include eggs or milk or fish. The three E's stand for environmentally sustainable, economically affordable, and evolutionarily appropriate interventions to improve nutrition. We are a group of people across campus and even across the globe that includes faculty, staff, and students that are focusing largely on nutrition interventions but coming at it from different disciplinary perspectives. So the E3 Nutrition Lab includes faculty from the School of Engineering, it includes faculty from the School of Medicine, and then of course from the Brown School. And we have doctoral students and master's students involved both in public health and social work. The niche that we fill, I think, at the Brown School in terms of public health is this transdisciplinary um, approach to problem solving.